Yeah. So, so when you say steam, wh wh how are they making this? Oh, I don't know how to say this. How are they making the steam? <laughs> uh, there's a steam plant over by BC Place. That's what I mean. I don't know what a steam plant is. What, 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 is it fire? Is it? What, no, they... it's like big boilers where oh, they're boilers. boiling okay. water mm -mm -mm. with these big furnace kind of machines. Mm -mm. And so that like it's creating. Drinks. Yeah. Well, yeah. instead of like putting it in a big stove with, mm -hmm. with coal, it's just some big boilers, right? So they're constantly producing steam that provides steam heat to many of the older buildings in downtown Vancouver. A lot of the older buildings actually have steam heaters, like those radiator things. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, they okay. Steam in the surely, surely. And one of, with that, one yeah. of the pipes goes to the clock. Okay, so but the water is coming from where? The, oh, the, the, there's they no shortage it. of water here. I mean, the, we I, do I get shortages right. in the summer, mm -hmm. but most of the year we get a lot of rain here. It's in a temperate rainforest. It goes from California up to Alaska. We're in the middle of it. Mm -hmm. So we actually get about 44 inches or 1,100 millimeters of rain in the year here on average at sea level, which translates in the winter into snow in the mountains. Mm -hmm. And so a lot of the year that snow is melting because we have a mild climate. Mm -hmm. Especially in the summer, it all melts and comes down and fills our reservoirs. Mm -hmm. So we have big reservoirs here at the base of our mountains. So three really big ones. Mm -hmm. One on the north shore at the base of Grouse Mountain called the Capilano Reservoir. Jackson actually supplies with about 40% of its drinking water. Wow. So now this clock was based on design from 1885. When you say this clock, you talk about this one, right? This little yeah. one here with, with the thing. Cast on steam clock. It's based oh. on the design from 1885, but it's not as old as it looks. This one was done by a master horologist in 1977. Yeah. Horologist, is that a clockmaker? Yeah. Or a watchmaker? Yeah. Oh, this, oh, that's cute. I thought it was going to be bigger. Okay. The gas down steam clock, the most photographed wow. object in Vancouver. Really? Uh, every 15 minutes, it sounds a steam whistle tune called the Westminster Chimes. Mm. Oh, I see. I right there. Take a photograph. Do I do that? Yeah, I'll pull ahead a little. Oh, there. no, don't worry. It's a... No, I'm going to do that for you. Mm. Yeah. And yeah. it's the most photographed. I feel that I should you know, contribute yeah. to that. Statistic. Yeah, this is going <laughs> to be slightly awkward because we're facing the steel chain link fence. So when you hop out, just be extra careful. Um, technically, I'm illegally stopped here right okay. now. Yeah, hold on a second.